minus one, one minute. minute. Rock, report range status. Range green. Forty-five. Vulcan tanks at step three. Thirty. EE four start box go. Twenty-eight. Verify ECS reduced for launch. Verified. Status Verified. check. Go Vulcan. Go Centaur. Go Cert two. Fifteen. T minus ten, yeah. nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We have engine ignition one and lift off of the United Launch Alliance Vulcan rocket carrying ULA's legacy of reliability, orbital accuracy, and high energy performance. Trending toward zero. Uh, BE4 is now throttling down, and we have SRB Jettison. Vulcan is 19 miles in altitude. We just heard confirmation of solid rocket booster jettison. We have about three minutes until we reach our next mission event, booster engine cutoff. RCS valve activation. Body race continue to look good. And we're now just about two minutes to nominal Bico. And we've had RCS valve activation. continues to look good. BE4s are performing as expected. Body rates are turning towards zero. And vehicles continuing down the range track. Traveling currently at 4,600 miles per hour. You have two good engines. Body rate's trending towards zero. 
and we're now about one minute to nominal ego. Vulcan is now one quarter of its liftoff weight. And Vulcan is now passing the Carmen line. And we've started boost phase chill down on the second stage engine. And the BE-4s are throttling to maintain a constant acceleration. And we've concluded our boost phase chill now. And PU has gone to open loop. And we have BECO, booster engine cutoff. And we have Vulcan Centaur separation. And pre-start on LH2 and LO2. And we have full thrust on the RL10. And bearing jettison has been indicated. And we've begun thermal loop conditioning on the RCS and fixed angles on Centaur PU. Vehicle is now 123 miles in altitude, 345 miles downrange, and traveling at 10,000 miles per hour. And we're getting indications that boost- Seven, six, five, four, three. We have engine ignition, one. And liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Vulcan rocket, carrying ULA's legacy of reliability, orbital accuracy, and high energy performance. Everything looking up. BE4 performing as expected. All temperatures and pressures looking good. Eagle has begun its pitch and raw program. Phenomenal, trending toward zero. Uh, BE4 is now throttling down, and we have SRB Jettison. Vulcan is 19 miles in altitude. We just heard confirmation of solid rocket booster jettison. We have about three minutes until we reach our next mission event, booster engine cutoff. on RCS valve activation. Body rates continue to look good.
And we're now just about two minutes to nominal Pico. And we've had RCS valve activation. Vehicle continues to look good. BE4s are performing as expected. Body rates are turning towards zero. And vehicles continuing down the range track. Traveling currently at 4,600 miles per hour. Can you have two good engines? Body rates trending towards zero. And we're now about one minute to nominal eco. Vulcan is now one quarter of its liftoff weight. And Vulcan is now passing the Carmen line. And we've started boost phase chill down on the second stage engine. And the BE4s are throttling to maintain a constant acceleration. And we've concluded our boost phase chill down. And PU has gone to open loop. And we have Beco booster engine cutoff. And we have Vulcan Centaur separation. And pre-start on LH2 and LO2. And we have full thrust on the RL10. And bearing jettison has been indicated. And we've begun thermal loop conditioning on the RCS and fixed angles on the PU. Vehicle is now 123 miles in altitude, 345 miles downrange, and traveling at 10,000 miles per hour. 